Hey guys and welcome back to Battlefront Updates. In this video I simply wanted to showcase all the cosmetic unlocks for the ships available in Star Wars Squadrons as with the early access a couple of months ago I did a video showing off the all the pilot cosmetics all the actual ship components you can unlock for the ships and so on. So if you want to see that, I will leave a link to that at the top of the description because uh, I didn't feel like it was necessary doing that over again. But I wanted to show you all the cosmetics here as that wasn't available back then. And there's actually some quite cool ones in there. It worries me a little bit that I think you might be able to unlock a lot of them very quickly or at least to the point where you have one of each that you're going to be happy with and then you really don't have anything to work towards. But nevertheless, I think there are some cool ones in there as you both have a hologram, it's something to put on your dashboard as well as a hanging flare. So there is a lot of different customization you can do there. And if you're wondering why I show it off on all the ships here, it's just because I figured it's better to do that than miss something out. Because first of all, some of the paint jobs are not available for all ships. And on top of that, uh, some of the cockpits looks very different. So the location of the hanging flash or the uh, holograms is going to be completely different. And for instance, I noticed that in the... Uh, the actual Thai cockpits, it was a little bit dark. So the hanging flare or the thing you put on your dashboard, it looks a little bit strange in that lighting. It might just be in the hangar and it might look different when you're actually playing the game with the unlocks. But nevertheless, I wanted to show them off. There are some really good ones in there, like a Vader figurine, a hanging Rancor, a destroyed Death Star, and similarly. And also some of those legendary uh, paint jobs actually look pretty cool. Normally paint jobs and the cals are, it's something you'll put on and you probably won't notice that much because well first of all it's only first person but some of those legendary uh, paint jobs are actually pretty neat so I think it's better off to save up to them than buying something cheap at least that's what I'm gonna do as uh, well I'd rather have one good paint job that I will use all the time than having some mediocre ones that I won't be happy with but nevertheless I'll let the re rest of the footage uh, roll and if you have any questions whatsoever uh, leave a comment below.